Okay. This is how to remove a light bulb from a Shimazu x-ray machine. Go ahead and remove the screws from the housing here. Located on the side of the body. Whoops. Housing removes just like that. And then when you get in here, you see there's a little shield over the light bulb here. We're going to go ahead and take these two screws off right here. Just loosen them up a little bit. And that little housing will kind of slide down, like so. Your old burned out light bulb is right in here. should just come out here, right out here. See the burned out filament in there, uh, maybe it's not one to focus on it, but it's burned out. <laughs> Here's our new one. <laughs> Did not turn off my phone notifications there. This is right here. This goes right inside of here. Just kind of pop it right back in place like so. We're going to go ahead and slide the housing back on here. while we screw the screws back down. There we go. And then we'll go ahead and put the housing back on here. Housing cover back on. Of course, using gloves makes this harder than it has to be. Now, I only use gloves because I was told that the bulbs are not supposed to be handled with bare hands. So, I don't know what if that's a major thing or not. Just do what I'm told here. Okay, that's good to go right there. And this is on a Shimazu Rad Speed machine. The collimator is Type R30H. I'm going to turn the power back on. Okay, the machine's coming back on here. I'll give it a second so we can move it around here. look and see if our collimator lights are working. Which it appears to be. So that's it pretty much. Um, 
take care and good luck. Any questions, just uh, ask me a question on the comment section. Thanks a lot.